Welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for January 19th until 25th. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. you're feeling like you're stuck in a situation you also feel like you're weathering the storm or it seems like your mind right now this week will be a little bit stormy now communications will also be blocked so expect that there will still be more arguments and that if you're not really going to be understanding each other especially if you're living together or if you're living with someone or if you're already married now you feel so stuck because you want to work or you're thinking about work, you're thinking about money, you're worried about money, but there's nothing that you can do at this point. Now there is somebody that you're thinking about, which is also another fire sign that can give you money or that can give you an opportunity. And you're also thinking about moving from one place to another, but you're, you're, you know, you're afraid you want some reassurance, you want some security that things are really going to work out well and it will be in your favor. However, when somebody or if someone will be reaching out to you for an opportunity or will be promising you that, yeah, let, you know, I'm going to take care of you, I have a job for you, or, you know, like uh, there's like a hiring or a position that's open in our company, so I'm going to take care of you. Unfortunately, that person is only just, you know, like um, playing games with you or whatever it is that they're offering as a position. It's not really what you really wanted to do. Now, changes are coming your way and it seems like right before it starts, you will be acting so proud and you will be thinking that you've already made the right decision. Now, when the time comes that you're starting working for that company or for that, you know, for that place that is the only time that you will know that everything is not what it seems and then you will end up walking away with much disappointment and i feel like if you're going to be working there for less than a month chances are you're not going to get paid with the days that you have worked there in that place okay so i feel like this person is also not that reliable or not that you know um they're not really that um, credible. So just be careful in believing other people's lies and promises, okay? Now, I also feel like some of you will be dealing with some family issues and some criticisms from your relatives or some expectations, high expectations. And at this point that you're thinking about, you know, like uh, putting yourself first before everything else or before everyone else, they're going to deem you and see you as a selfish person. But you have tried to, you know, like you have tried to like do your best and you have tried to um, be the person that they expect you to be. But it seems like it will never be good enough, you know, for everyone, even if you'll be give, even, even if you will give your entire life. It will never be good enough for them. So this is the time that you will be setting your boundaries and you'll be drawing the lines that enough is enough. 
Now, you will also be cutting off a few people or friends that you've been in touch with, especially right after this false opportunity that somebody will be recommending you. And hopefully it's not really far <clears throat> to wherever you are right now, okay? Because I feel like the opportunity that you're going to be availing that you feel and think that it will be very beneficial is a place where it's a little bit further away from wherever you're staying right now. Now, there will also be some lies and deceptions and alibis that you... Well, either you're the one who's going to be doing it or that you're going to be receiving it from an air sign. Okay? There is also some sort of a manipulation that's been ongoing or that will be happening. And right before you notice that these people are just trying to play around with your mind or just trying to manipulate you, everything is already like, you know, done, done. Then, and there will also be some damages that will be done and harm. I don't feel like there will be some harm, but it's more of emotional damage or... Uh, not really physical damage, but it's more of mental and emotional, okay? Um, you will also be going against the wishes and whatever it is that your partner is desiring because of your family members or because of your relatives, okay? Now, there is another correspondence that you'll be receiving upon um, going through with the new opportunities by the end of this week, and it seems like um, you will also be having some regrets about leaving your past job, okay, in the past. You'll also try to reach out to this person from the past, which is a water sign, and that you've already set your boundaries from, but then you feel like this is the last straw, or this is going to be your last hope for you to have a job and for you to find a job, all right? I don't feel like this is, you know, really the case, but I feel like there has been some codependencies in this relationship as well. Now, if you are single, um, there will also be some issues with somebody that you, either you're dating with right now or that you're about to see because of their child. It seems like they're a single parent and, the, you know, this person is a single parent and the, the, you don't want to get involved much with their dramas so there is a decision that you have to make now if this person is somebody that you haven't met this is an air sign or fire sign if this is somebody that you haven't met it seems like you need to make a decision whether this is really worthy pursuing or this is just like you know i mean the person is good I, i'm not saying that the person is not really worth it but you're not yet ready for this kind of situation or for this kind of, what do you call this, like um, having an instant family. So, well, because I feel like the other person will always prioritize their, you know, their kid rather than their love life. And you feel like you're just waiting on the line for whatever that will be a leftover. Left over of their time, left over of their attention, left over of their emotions. So, yes, the you know the person is wonderful. They they look so promising. They're very brilliant, one of a kind, and very interesting. But know where you will be standing with this person, or if they can also prioritize you, aside from being just a wallflower. Now, when it comes to your family, okay, let's go back to your family again because it seems like there will be some arguments that will be forming between you and your parents about a particular lie, opportunity, or something that they just grabbed, you know, which is very risky without even asking you or discussing it with you, you know, especially if they're really old. It's more of a very impulsive decision. And there is also money involved, okay? So, they're just going to let out a very, like a huge amount to a certain person believing that, you know, that investment can actually grow and they're only thinking about you. But the way you're going to be lashing at them is, it's like, you know, like they're being selfish or something like that. 
but you have to, and, you know like b before you say something make sure that you'll be getting to know the truth first because otherwise when you you know if you'll be hurting your parents or your family at this point it's gonna be like long months to go without them okay so i feel like it's not that easy but it's um it's something that you really need to focus on as well you know like uh, saying the right thing reacting at the right time and not really hurting anyone even though you're only giving out your opinion all right anyway that's it for you for this week touch and if you want to talk to me live at the phone and live at the calls just go and visit me at my website at sophie.net blessings to you